Hey everyone. The first thing I would like to do is introduce you to Alex Johansson. Everyone, this is Alex. Alex, this is everyone. This girl is one of the smartest, hardworking, and kindest people I know. And I wanted you all to know her too. You look amazing, Alex, and I appreciate our friendship. Thank you so much for standing up here with me. Next, Mom, Dad, and Christy, I love you. Okay, the King's Academy. Not only do you learn academics here, but TKA forces you to build character. Now I'm thinking that I won't ever have another chance to address the whole student body. So this is a little segment I'd like to call Life Lessons with Kyle. Lesson number one. If you ever find yourself back in junior kindergarten and Nick Van Reith tells you that his dad will throw you in jail, don't believe him. Lesson, don't allow fear to ruin your entire year. The worst cases you can think of rarely ever happen. Lesson number two, don't pull your pants down in public on a dare. Now, I learned this lesson the hard way. Hey, wait, it was kindergarten. Apologies to Emily and Sophia. And thanks to my dad, who severely disciplined me. Otherwise, Nick's dad would actually have to arrest me. Lesson number three, don't act like you are a victim of everything bad or inconvenient that comes your way. Things happen for a reason, and God has a plan. If you don't make a team or get playing time, if you don't get the part, be sad, then move on. Don't blame others. It actually was you. You weren't good enough. But that's okay. It's okay to not be the best. Getting mad and obsessing doesn't change your circumstances, and it makes you look like a jerk. We have it awesome here at King's, and if you compare yourself to some people with real struggles, such as the people we are helping through our homecoming donations in Guatemala, who have no house, your perspective will change. Lesson number four, apologize for things you do wrong, even if you didn't mean to do them and be interested in others. This has saved all of my friendships and relationships. You are not cooler or better because you are right, and it shows that you value them. Lesson five. Every year, I played a sport, but I am naturally a stage guy. So lesson five, check your pride. How I learned it? Football. It is very difficult to remain prideful as you're gasping for oxygen while a 400 pound kid takes his sweet time getting off the pile. Tough people do win. I'm grateful to each and every one of you, friends, teachers, coaches, directors, and family who have taught me all of these lessons and more. I love Kings and all of you. Go Lions.